Hey guys, so I'm talking about something that I absolutely love. Now, you're creative, a visionary, artsy in your craft. This isn't the sexy thing, but it is the profitable thing. And I am excited to talk to you about it today and how it has impacted my life. Now, let me start by saying that I wasn't always a planner. So I considered myself this free spirit. And my mom started buying me a planner like every year since maybe high school. And I'd write in it for a little while and then I couldn't even find the thing. <laughs> you know, like literally I couldn't even find it. And then she just kept sending them every year around October of every single year. And then I began writing in the planner and, you know, maybe do it for about three months and then I'd fall off and all of a sudden I started realizing where I was getting the most traction in my life and in my business and planning became super, super important to me. Even more so when I opened my first brick and mortar service based business, I got married and had a baby all in a three year time frame. There was a little trouble in paradise. There was some trouble in paradise behind the scenes. So my personal life was rolling over into my business. I was overwhelmed frustrated, exhausted, and I said, hey, I have to get unstuck. It's when I became really, really serious about planning. Now, I had picked up habits before by way of planning, like in creating systems. So for whatever reason, systems were always my thing. It's actually one of my superpowers now. And one of the things I help my clients to do in growing their business, but I began to understand the impact that planning for my future growth, for the future things that I desired in my life, I began to recognize just how powerful they were. And today I'm going to share with you five things that planning has done for my life and for my business. So I'm Tanya Wilson Cherry, growth strategist, the growth strategist, business coach and mentor to women service based business owners just like yourself. I help you to brand, build, and profit in your business, but not just in your business, also in your life. And if you think back to what I said, it's so important that we're not only planning our business, but it's in alignment with our lives because they intertwine and the stuff going on in our personal life, it'll roll over into our business and it's just important. I actually teach this concept called the six elements of life alignment, where we break down different categories of your life from your career and finances, family and relationships, different segments, and so that you can properly plan for prosperity in all areas of your life. So I believe that success is a full circle experience. I teach from a three point perspective, abundance mindset. So our thinking, even our thinking about whether or not we should plan, um, is an abundant state, but I teach on abundance mindset, personal growth and business building. And I absolutely love what I am able to do in the world and the women I am able to serve. I'm the founder of 3D Success Academy for women in business who want to grow their life, their business and their brand. And on today, I just want to share with you five things that planning has done for my life. So if you are like me and you're like, I'm a free spirit. Listen, I'm going to just tell you how planning has changed my life and my business. Number one. So, you know, I wrote some things down for you. It has allowed me to form systems to follow. So because I have an overall plan and vision for my life, I call it destiny by design, which is one of our tracks inside 3D Success Academy. It allows me to see where is it that I really want to go. Do you know how it feels to maybe start a new product, a new service, um, or a new business, and you don't really have a plan for where it's going to go? And then you're like, why am I even doing this? This is not even making sense to me anymore. I don't want to do this anymore. And oftentimes that feeling comes because we didn't have a plan. And so we're hit with all of these things that we're like putting out fires instead of, you know, being in a productive space of actually letting the business grow or helping the business to grow. And so planning gives me systems so that I can follow. And that way I don't feel so confused and overwhelmed and you know, I can recognize when something is not in alignment 
for where I actually desire to go. Number two, the number two thing that planning has done for me, planning the growth of my business, it has kept me focused. So it's kept the main thing the main thing. You guys get that? I remember when I opened my brick and mortar service based business tent, um, I actually opened it and was in business for 10 years prior to consulting full time. And my overall goal was to open up 10 of those locations um, eventually, right? But I had to work on the foundation. And when I realized that I needed a stronger foundation, I was able to focus more and keep the main thing the main thing and at least allow that one location to be successful. I believe that many people, if they make the main thing the main thing, they will learn what to do. It will be more profitable. It will be more successful or they'll recognize this isn't really what I desire to do. So planning has a lot, has kept me focused. It's helped me to keep the main thing the main thing. So I'm not trying 25 different things that have nothing to do with where I truly desire to go, how I want my life to be, what's not in alignment with my values. So planning has allowed me to um, stay focused. How many of you need to stay focused? How many of you feel like, you know, I could really use another level of focus in my life. Get a plan. It will definitely help you to do that. A clear plan, clarity on your plan. Number three, it's saved me time. So planning has saved me time and I'm so glad that when I decided to bring my business online, so I was consulting part-time, kind of like a part-time hustle, if you want to call it that, because I hadn't seriously put my time, energy, and efforts into consulting. I was taking clients on the side that I was serious about, but not about making it a full-time experience. And so um, it, it saved me I'm making it a full-time experience and so it saved me time from trying things that they had nothing to do with where I was going so when I came online there are all these other businesses people doing the things that I do um, tons of people that I could help and because I knew what it is that I wanted to do not just in that moment but over an extended period of time, it definitely kept me more focused. And whenever I felt like I was getting off track, I would refer back to my destiny by design. I would refer back to the vision that I had. You know, it's really easy to get distracted, but when you have a plan, you can definitely stay focused. It has definitely done that for me. Number four, having a plan has allowed me more time freedom. So, the concept of sitting down and planning something out, taking the time to reflect, may feel like it's taking up time, but prepare time is never lost time. And what I learned is as I began to plan more, I actually had more free time. It's kind of like going to the grocery store and you don't have a list. So you're kind of like all over the store. You may even end up leaving the store without getting some of the items you need and have to go back. All of that is lost time. And it happens in our business. So when we don't have a plan, we're more likely to skip steps. We're more likely to go left. So planning for me has allowed me more time freedom. I actually can see the amount of free time that I'm gonna have. I have more free time now than I've ever had. It's an amazing space that I'm operating in, but it was because I had a plan. It's because not only do I have an extended plan three, five years from now, but I reverse engineer it, decide what I'm going to do month to month, quarterly, weekly, daily, and it allows me to plan my free time. It allows me to plan time even for self-care. So having a plan for my life, my business, and the growth of it has definitely allowed me more time freedom. And time freedom is one of the concepts that many women who come to me are definitely looking for. And so when we're strategizing and creating the plans for their business and their brand, we're incorporating the fact that they wanna be working smarter and not harder because they want to have time freedom to do the things that they love. Like nobody really wants to have to do their business all the time or feel tied to their business. It was definitely, not something that I wanted to do. And I learned it deeply 
when I owned a brick and mortar service based business. So it taught me prior to opening this business how I wanted to build the next business. I didn't necessarily want to, you know, build my business and then figure out how I was going to do all of the things that I love. I wanted to build my business so that it allowed me to do those things with harmony. So, you know, have work-life harmony. So having a plan definitely gives me work-life harmony. Let me see, what number are we on? Number five, it allows me to be consistent, guys. So one of the things I do before each new year comes in, I spend about the last quarter of each year preparing for my new year. So I look at my destiny by design, my overall vision, and then I figure out what do I need to do in this year in order to move the needle forward. And because I have that, it allows me to be consistent and consistent on the right things. So oftentimes you may have found yourself doing this where you start something and then stop and then go on to something else and there's no consistency. There's no time to gain momentum. Uh, there's no time to gain the traction that's needed. Um, and people got to know, like, and trust you. And if there's 50 different things that you are doing, you're less likely to actually even do them well. Um, I believe that training and mastery Practice and consistency is super important for the brand that you're building, the business that you're building, and the lifestyle that you want to create. And so planning has allowed me to, you know, develop the systems, have time freedom, be consistent on the right things, right? Because I believe that we're all consistent in something. Just deciding whether or not we're being consistent on the right things is so important. And the fact that I have a plan gives me something to measure. So I have systems, I can measure them. I'm being consistent on something so I can see when things are growing my business or impacting them ne negative, negatively. And maybe I need to shift, tweak, change, just a little something, but never, never, never the plan. Right. So maybe we change the strategy, but not the vision, not the destiny, you know, um, not the plan. So planning has been impactful and powerful in my life. I hope that you're empowered to um, get in a space where you can really, really get clear on what your destiny by design should look like, what your vision is, and then take time out to plan. My 3D Success Academy, I don't know if I shared that in this video, but I'm the founder of 3D Success Academy for women in business where we work on their business, their life, and their brand. And inclusive in that is getting really, really clear. It is a year-long opportunity. And some people, when they hear a year, you know, it scares them a little bit, but it's an opportune time to plan, have focus, put things into action, get more profits, get more profits have more impact in the marketplace because of the momentum, because of the focus, because of the systems that you create while you're there because of your clarity. So having a plan has hugely impacted my life and my business, my family's life. And I encourage you to get in a space where you really decide what it is that you desire for your business, your business growth, your business expansion, your life, your family's life, and then develop a plan to get there. I'd love to support you in the opportunity to um, really get clear and design your destiny. Don't let it happen by default. That's my take on today. I will see you guys on the next video. There is power in planning.